constant innovation, unparalleled education, groundbreaking global business education you'll find only at Oxford College of Business. That's because all we do, all we are. Proceeding commenced today with additional Solicitor General Yasanta Kodagore making an application. He sought an order to the Director of Witness Protection Division of Police to set up an interim witness protection task force to investigate death threats leveled by Shanil Netkumara to Anika Vijay Surya and her family. Later, Steve Samuel, personal assistant of Arjun Locius, was questioned on the text and email messages extracted from his mobile phone. When asked if he realized that Alocius corresponded business dealings with persons named PM, RK, AM and Saman Indunil Kumara, mentioned in the messages, Samuel said he did not know. At the end of the session, the Commission's Chairman, Justice K.T. Chitrasiri, revealed that a list of questions had been sent to Prime Minister Anil Vikramasinghe, to which he should provide answers in the form of an affidavit. Additional Solicitor General Yasanta Kodagora, meanwhile, told the Commission that Perpetual Treasuries Limited is a criminal organisation that acted unlawfully with the support of influential politicians and other individuals. 